The HRX-075 is Hydrorain's top performing rotary sprinkler with an easy to match precipitation nozzle system. We're going to discuss a few of the features, show you how to change out a nozzle, and make some adjustments. I'm Dwayne Smith, your sprinkler warehouse product specialist. Let's get started. The HRX-075 by Hydrorain is an adjustable arc rotor that's perfect for lawn or garden areas. Its arc can be adjusted anywhere from 40 to 360 degrees. The pop-up height on this rotor is 4 inches and it has a 3 quarter inch inlet right here. It has a watering distance of 22 to 52 feet depending on the nozzle installed and how the adjustment screw is set. The HRX-075 comes with this set of nozzles right here. One of the things that Hydro Rain has done to make nozzle selection easier is they've created what they call the easy to match precipitation nozzle system. Let's talk for just a second about match precipitation. Let's say you have one rotor that goes 360 degrees, another rotor going 180 degrees, and another rotor only covering 90 degrees, and they're all in the same zone. And they all have the same nozzle installed. The 180 degree rotor will cover the same patch of grass twice for each time the 360 degree rotor goes around once. So that patch of grass serviced by the 180 degree rotor gets twice as much water as the patch watered by the 360 degree rotor. And the rotor that goes 90 degrees will cover the same patch of lawn four times for every one time the 360 degree rotor will turn, netting it four times as much water. So Hydro Rain has created an easy way to handle that issue. To achieve match precipitation, use nozzle number one for a 90 degree pattern, number two for a 180 degree pattern, number three for a 270 degree pattern, and number four for a 360 degree pattern. Let's talk about the adjustments that you can make on this rotor. Looking at the top of the rotor, this is the radius adjustment slot. That sets your watering distance. You'll use the metal end of the tool to adjust that. This is the pull up slot. Use the plastic end of the tool to insert in there, turn and pull up. And over here, this is the arc adjustment slot. Use the plastic end of the tool for that. Let's go look at one that's already been installed. Here's how to change out a nozzle. Insert the plastic end of the rotor tool into the lifting socket, turn, and pull up. I'm using a hold-up collar to hold the riser up while I work, but if you don't have one, you can hold it up with your hand. Back out the radius adjustment screw. Pry out the nozzle with a small flathead screwdriver. Insert the new nozzle with the divot that accepts the radius adjustment screw toward the top. It will go in at a slight downward angle. Screw back down the radius adjustment screw to hold the nozzle in place. Don't tighten it all the way, we'll use it to make adjustments in just a bit. Now with the water going, use the radius adjustment screw to set your watering distance. You want the spray from this rotor to reach the next rotor over. You can turn the turret back and forth to see how the arc is set. To adjust the arc, use the plastic end of the rotor tool and the arc adjustment slot. Turn clockwise to increase the arc and counterclockwise to decrease. And that is the HRX-075 by Hydrorain. Pick up some today on sprinklerwarehouse.com. Remember, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything you need to make your trees, lawn, flower beds, and gardens lush and beautiful. Questions? Chat with one of our incredible customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really do know their stuff, and they'll get you squared away. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for helpful tips, tutorials, and general sprinkler instruction. Sprinkler Warehouse, America's most shop sprinkler store.